the man in red. On December 6, Benjamin opened the next door and saw a man in red. It grew darker and darker. The path to Bethlehem seemed immeasurably long to the little bear. Snowflakes blew in his face. He closed his eyes for a moment. He was so sleepy. The little bear yawned. Before him stood a man dressed in red with a large sack sung, slung over his back, leading a donkey. Hello there, said little bear. My name is Nicholas. What are you doing out on such a cold night? I'm following the star to Bethlehem to see the child that will be born, muttered the bear. Nicholas smiled. Then we're going the same way, he said. Without waiting for a reply, he lifted the little bear onto his donkey. When they reached the village, the little bear saw children peering out of brightly lit windows. What are they waiting for, he wondered. Then he saw empty plates and boots in front of doors. Nicholas opened his large sack. It was filled with apples, nuts, and gingerbread. Will you help me, little bear? The little bear nodded and cheerfully passed out all the goodies. Now the sack is empty, said the bear, disappointed. We've given away everything. And because we did, we're nearer to Bethlehem, replied Nicholas. The little bear rubbed his eyes. It was morning. The sun was shining. Next to him lay a small sack with a card that read for the little bear. I am glad the little bear got some goodies too, said Benjamin. Yes, agreed Mother Bear, but remember that sharing with others brings us closer to God.